Back in December, we saw sparks flying and metal welded. A six foot orb taking shape before our eyes. This is the most ambitious one yet. Now, four months later, this piece of art is done, ready for all to see. Should we turn it? Yes. Let's turn it. The huge sphere is full of detail. It's grandness, even amazing its creator. This weighs uh, about 400 pounds, and we lost count of how many pieces are in there. Something this big is an amazing feat for any artist, but especially for Don Gelinella. I get a, some very surprised looks, you know, mostly in the supermarket <laughs> where they don't know me. <laughs> the shaky hands give them away. Oh, it's frustrating as hell. I mean, you know, try to eat a taco. I mean, you know, it's like, it's, it's a disaster area. Humor intact as he battles full-blown Parkinson's. He gets looks, sure. Your problem is right out there for everybody to see but everybody's got some kind of a problem that you can't see, so they can relate to it. After five years with Parkinson's, Jelinella now doesn't create alone. He gets help from assistants like Hope and Alicia Prather. I think knowing Don and his struggles and how open he, he has to be, because like he said, it's not something that you can hide, but everybody's always going through something. So he's been very understanding to just be human and that is really really nice to see in a boss and a partner. Now complete, this orb made the trip east on I-4 over to Orlando's newest fire station number nine. Shiny and bright, standing 11 feet tall. It's just beautiful. It, it's better than I had imagined. It really looks great. It welcomes eyes to take it in, in all its glory bold and visible, just like its creator. There's nothing to hide. You know, you are what you are, Wh whatever you think your, your personal issues are, people accept you for who you are and you just have to um, accept yourself for who you are. Enjoying this bird's eye view in Orlando. I couldn't have done it without a crew of people helping. I'm Erin Murray, Spectrum News.